Hello, I am Abhijit Varade, Founder, Director and Chief Operating Officer of Akshay Agri. Well, we chose Telangana as a state for our manufacturing and R&D facility primarily for three reasons. One, opportunity is available. Second, the local administration support. And the third, the great local talent base available. First, opportunities. Telangana as a state and the adjoining states have been traditionally or historically been early adopters of technology in the agricultural space. Products in the harvesting and post-harvesting space tend to be voluminous in nature and they are manufactured in the northern region of India. We have based ourselves in the state of Telangana that helps us to mitigate the logistics challenge of transporting these voluminous machines from the northern India to southern India. Right from day one when we thought of Telangana as a location, the kind of support we have received from Telangana as a state and the local administration has been really astounding. The fact that our R&D facility was up in six months is a great proof of that support that we have received from the local administration. And lastly, and most importantly, the great talent ecosystem that Telangana as a state offers. Not only great local talent, but also a great startup ecosystem aided by infrastructure like T-Hub that makes it an ideal ground for us to have technology collaborations and moving ahead in the agricultural technology space. Our focus, our key focus areas at this point of time, apart of building the infrastructure and also creating job opportunities in the state, is primarily on development of vendor partners for us. As of now, we are more than 50% of our parts developed locally from the state of Telangana for manufacturing of the combines. And the others are very much following from a localization standpoint and would be soon sourcing almost close to 100% of the products from the state as we go ahead. Not only on the vendor partners, our focus areas is also on make, ensuring that we are rolling out quality products from our line with the right quality and with the right test parameter. As our products hit the fields, they're going to have certain needs for support and we're ensuring that our customer support channel is ready and trained along with the right availability of parts to make sure that our customers are up and running all the time. Well, we started building our R&D facility in August 21 and by January 22, we had the facility up and running. Currently, we're leveraging that facility for the initial manufacturing of our products. Our bigger manufacturing setup is going to be 100 kilometers away from the R&D facility in a location called Narmala in Sirsila district. That facility would be up and running in the next 12 to 18 months of time. The manufacturing facility footprint and the layouts are, get, are being prepared at this point of time and the foundational works for the new facility would be starting soon. You'll get to hear more updates about our manufacturing facilities on the next episodes of the Farmside Chat.